uh, we are getting initial reports that uh, the pilot and those uh, uh, you know pilot is safe and an IF fighter jet uh, MiG-21 has crashed in Rajasthan this is a big, big breaking news that uh, that is coming in it's uh, in the Hanumangar district of Rajasthan and uh, of course uh, given the fact that there have been at least six crashes involving the fighter jet MiG-21 questions on the safety of uh, MiG-21 have been raised time and again. Um, we will try and get more as far as the story is concerned, but initial reports suggest that the pilot is safe. That is what uh, our senior uh, defense correspondent Rajiv Ranjan has confirmed that the pilot is safe, but uh, the MiG-21 has crashed in Rajasthan. Uh, now, this is in Hanumangar of uh, Rajasthan and uh, Remember, there have been uh, nearly six crashes involving MiG-21 since January uh, 20, 2021. Uh, now, of course, questions have been raised as far as the safety of this particular aircraft is concerned. Uh, there has been data by uh, the Ministry of Defense that has said that, uh, uh, you know, five pilots lost their lives in the earlier crashes involving MiG-21. But as far as this particular crash is concerned, the initial reports that we have uh, suggests that the pilot is safe, the pilot is unhurt as far as the crash is concerned. Um, now, if you talk about other data involving MiG-21, um, remember uh, there have been over 400 MiG-21s that have crashed in the last 60 years, which is why, uh, you know, uh, it, it has also gotten that epithet of the flying coffin. Uh, so those larger questions have been raised as far as the safety of MiG-21 is concerned. But fortunately, in this situation, the pilot is safe. Um, there have been no reports as far as uh, deaths or casualties involving the crash uh, is concerned. And uh, now it's confirmed that the pilot is safe. There have been earlier instances where uh, pilots have lost their lives in uh, you know various crashes involving uh, the MiG-21. In fact, there was uh, earlier uh, a MiG-21 crash in Rajasthan's Barmer as well, if I recall correctly. And uh, the Air Force has had initiated an inquiry as far as that particular crash uh, was concerned. That was a MiG-21 Bison fighter jet that had crashed in Rajasthan's Barmer. Uh, now, of course, uh, nearly six incidents, over six incidents have been reported. There you can see uh, these are pictures uh, from uh, the ground. Uh, there, you, there you can see those uh, pictures of uh, the crash. It happened in Hanumangar in Rajasthan. In fact, I'm being joined by Harsha Kumari Singh, uh, who reports out of Rajasthan. Harsha, uh, so uh, what, what are initial reports suggesting? Uh, we have it confirmed by a senior defense correspondent that uh, the pilot is safe. Uh, there have been no casualties reported, but uh, what are you hearing? Well, uh we are hearing is that, you know, uh, we are not sure exactly where that aircraft landed. But we are hearing that there are two civilian casualties also. Now, exactly how that happened is not clear because there are some visuals coming in which are showing a helicopter landing to rescue those two pilots. So that helicopter appears to be on a rescue mission. Now, did that make a uh, fall on someone's house which led to two people, two civilians dying? Or was that somewhat unrelated? We are not. And since we don't have, uh, you know, confirmed information, we don't want to uh, sort of, uh, you know, put out I incorrect information. We are hearing reports. We have not confirmed. Yeah. I would like to mm -hmm. underline again. We have not confirmed from the district administration. Yeah. Two people have died, one woman and a man, two civilian casualties. And we are hearing that the pilots have, of course, ejected to safety. All right, Harsha. So there you're saying that uh, there could have been two civilian casualties involving um, this particular incident. However, it's uh, it's almost confirmed now that the pilot is safe. Uh, but we're still awaiting confirmation as far as the two civilian casualties are uh, concerned. Um, now, as far as the ground situation is concerned, Harsha, uh, you know, you, you said that you're not sure of uh, where it happened particularly. But give us a sense of Hanumangar, um, you know, uh, where it's situated actually. And uh, because remember earlier as well, there was a crash in Rajasthan. Barmer uh, that also involved MiG-21. So give us a sense of this particular area. Yes, absolutely. You see, uh, we do know that it's happened in Hanumangar. It's on the border uh, with Punjab. And this place is, um, uh, you know, it's, uh, 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 I mean, uh, uh, it's on the border with Punjab. Uh, that much we know. We also know that uh, this, the, where it fell exactly, there's a, a village called Bahol Nagar. Um, that's where this has happened, and this is about 10 kilometers from a place called uh, Pilibanga. Now, uh, 
more information that is coming in is that you know uh, the local police station is saying that the uh, there were three women uh, who were sitting on a roof and out of that uh, one man uh, has been injured and one woman has also been injured and two people now we are hearing have died now um, exactly again like i'm saying uh, how that happened uh, we are not uh, very very clear uh, just to give you a sense of where hanumangar is um, there is a it's it's on the border with punjab it's called pili banga it's north of pili banga it's a place called bahol nagar where this has happened now local reports seem to suggest that the helicopter has crashed but i don't think that is possible because the helicopter apparently was there for the rescue operation so the helicopter was uh, uh, was there for the rescue operation and um, we're still trying to talk to police sources uh, uh, before we confirm anything All right, Harsha. So there, you're saying that uh, it's it's confirmed that the pilot is safe, but of course there could have been two civilian uh, casualties. Now, whether that involves this particular MiG-21 or not, that is yet to be confirmed. Uh, but as we've been pointing out earlier as well. that th- there have been a lot of questions raised on the safety of the mig 21 given the fact that uh, you know it has resulted into uh, pilot casualties earlier you know given the fact that uh, ministry of defense data suggests that there have been uh, over 150 casualties in the past 60 years involving the mig 21 so uh, you know that's why it's also that given that epithet uh, questions on its safety uh, being raised as well uh, so as far as this incident is concerned the initial report suggests that the pilot is safe these are visuals from uh, hanumangarh there and as harsha was pointing out hanumangarh uh, is a border um, you know is situated on the border in the border area uh, between um, india and pakistan uh, so there you can see visuals of course chaos there on the ground uh, given the fact that uh, this crash has been reported there and it's uh, definitely caused a loss of uh, property there but whether it has caused uh, civilian casualties now that is the big question right now we are still trying to get confirmation on that uh, but what we can tell you for sure is that uh, we do know that the pilot is safe and unhurt